Welcome back to your hill today. My name is Jake. Let us continue from here. Uh, did we already do? S yeah, there was nothing. To put. If we get to have a mystery lingering, <laughs> blue refrigerator. Meaning that it's blue. Oh, there is something here. What's this box? Please use as you wish. 361802. Oh, there's even. Uh, I'll probably get this, but I'll, I'll write this down. Yeah. Obtain the long narrow box. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what was going on? So we 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 got now. Now to come to her senses, maybe, unless he had, she had hidden the <laughs> the head somewhere. Uh, Gone B was here last time. Maybe we can move onwards now. There were some. Numbers and stuff. The second floor. Oh, should I check everywhere? I'll pause and check other places. Yeah, I quickly checked around. So went kind of where in the bar, but they didn't say anything new. Mm. Uh, I should check these rooms. Pretty fun now, you did good, thanks. No, I'm sorry for worrying you. Don't sweat it, especially because you're safe. Now, very bad, right? Don't take off anymore, right? Okay. But, but you, you don't wanna be? If my <laughs> if my makeup my, <laughs> my makeup scary, I can't take it off. <laughs> That's not it, I'm very happy. All right. I'll do my best to wake up for traveling. You know. We're fine now. Thanks, Sarah. No problem. No problem. Number zero two is displayed above the door. What could this number mean? Zero two no mm. So if you look at this the middle door is zero two, so maybe a36 is the one that's right here. Uh. Oh, so maybe it's 380. Like, uh, 
Yeah. Black door, three, zero, and the light door. What about the numbers? Three, eight, zero. Easy every time. An electric paper shredder is a machine for shredding documents and such. There are lots of shredded pieces inside. How about it, Sarah? You see anything of interest? This? What was that sound? Uh, just garbage. Probably just a waste of time to check it out, huh? Hmm. But creating the documents from all this paper would be very time consuming. Ah. Uh, I'll try searching it now. Sure. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Jinji is all fired up now. I'll watch him till he's done. It's nice. Jin is investigating the scraps inside. Maybe Jin started to regain his spirits and. Light is pointed at the blackboard. How are you here as well? Oh, he, she said. I don't know why, but. So you're still doing the same in that room over there. No worries, sir. And the numbers were. 612. Door open. Oh god, <laughs> what's this? There's a hand cuff at the end of a chain. I wonder what this is. Plus the air in this room feels heavy. Well, this place is not good. How do you mean that? Hmm. I can sense a bad feeling somehow. So please tell me. Dots. I'm betting somebody died here. Hmm? I can faintly smell blood. Uh, huh? uh, and since there's dust, it was wiped a little while ago. I'd put the time around, yeah, maybe the first try. Once I became cognizant of it, I understood. The unremovable raw stench of blood. The air that reposed my instincts. It's disgusting. I want to throw up. Oh fuck. What was that? I was like <laughs> rubbing my eye. Just then and only catched a glimpse of it. Don't imagine it. Okay, so it was your imagination, I guess. Feeling your limits, sir. EG. I'll check every inch of this room. You get out, sir. But I'm saying trust in your friendly policeman. With a gentle push on the back, I proceeded to exit out of the room. Suspicious. Not letting me investigate. I think an empty room could make it me drum. It's been planted in me, the fear of death. I can't go into the black room. No, the white room. I'll do my best. What could this number mean? Starting to What was the significance of Alice's name? I just can't remember.
Hemisphere. So, and. Uh, aren't you tired? It's not good to work too hard. You should take some time to rest. Mm. I am energetic as. The I can't rest. Not while everyone else is working hard. I'd say rest is a valuable option in its own right. Still, you never know who'll come attacking you, so I know how you feel, Miss Sarah. Don't. Miss Sarah, I don't think you should go to the first floor, you know. But. Don't. Er, hey. Just your best friend, right? Yeah, I guess Joe is my best friend. Maybe I'll. I could get more info out of him if I say this. Like, he's obviously trying to play some games or. or just to tell he's suspicious of him. But if I say this, he'll be like, ah, ha, 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 well, never mind then. But will this have some kind of... Some kind of... Problems between Sarah and Joe, if I answer this. <laughs> it feels like I'm picking, <laughs> always picking the choice where Joe is like, put down. Then again, should we lie to him? Maybe not. He was like, nah, ha, ha, it's not a car, sir. <laughs> and you tried to lie to me before. <laughs> so yeah, let's say Joe's my best friend. I don't know if he is, but I don't know. Yeah, let's just maybe so start trusting him if I say this. Yes, he can be a bit stupid in ways, but he's a really good guy. Uh huh. Miss Sarah, you trust Joe? Don't. So what about Joe? I know he says, uh, never mind. <laughs> Miss Sarah. <laughs> Miss Sarah. So he came very close to me and spoke in a whisper. Do you remember that vote? Yeah, I, I did. Think about who voted for who. Back there. Uh, I had nearly forgotten. No, I'd be trying to forget. The second trial, the world in which Professor Mishima died. Uh, about this thing. If someone died in that room during the first trial, maybe it was Sean B's partner, since, he, since he's alone here right now. Excluding my own vote, Mishima got three votes, so and now got zero votes, and everyone else got one vote each. Well. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I want it for God. <laughs> but of course, without that choice, help no meaning. You see, I voted for Joe. So if that's true, then Joe voted for Mishima as well. Probably. Did 
How many votes did Sarah get? Zero? Maybe. Do you know what that means? Yes. Sorry. That must be bewildered you. We'll be going to catch you later. Da -da 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 -da. Joe didn't vote for himself. Well, he was feeling very guilty after afterwards, so could be true. Don't think you can really blame someone for like no one knew unless unless they knew no one knew that <laughs> if that makes sense no one knew that someone would die from that vote so I don't think it's wrong to... like yeah it's okay to feel guilty about it but like it wasn't malicious It wasn't so the one who came up with that. Let's tell how we voted. Where did you go, so? Let's check this quickly since we can. Joe. Joe is the thing that I'm wearing. He's staring at something in his hand. We can see. Piece of paper. Kind of seems like a card. Don't tell me. Okay, so he has one of these things, probably. Oh, Sarah, you startled me. What are you looking at? Dots. This was in my inside pocket. That's... It was a photo of me, Joe and Ryoko. So that was Sarah's friend that she introduced to Joe in the beginning, I guess. We were at the cafe having a fun chat together. Dot, 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 dot. Uh, do we miss real cool? Dots. Yeah. Dots. And I miss her. Dots. Sure enough, it's unthinkable for me to suspect you. So, he must just be seeing shadows where there aren't any. Well, I don't think I should. Just ignore what we're told. Like, also gives. gives insight into how. <laughs> Sorry, I'm yelling. How so? Things and acts and stuff. Certainly, uh, I thought back. Joe got involved in this because he came to my house. If he'd gone straight home, wouldn't he be living life as normal right now? How late the realization is that? I was so focused on myself, I didn't consider Joe's perspective for a second. I had my first proper date with Ryoko that day. And I was so nervous I couldn't talk to him. Somehow we ended up... Blah, 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 we ended up... Blah, we ended up talking about you, sir. <laughs> Do you remember that time you tried to sit on a traffic corner and fell on your butt? I couldn't stop laughing. You promised me you wouldn't tell me. Ah, it's your got the conversation live. So then I sort of asked her why she decided to go out with me. Oh god, a new voice for character whose face I haven't seen. Huh? 
What do you mean what? I mean, you didn't know me that much, yeah? Aha, uh -huh, really? Well, no friend of Sarah's could be a bad person, you know? Ah, uh, honey, right? Because I was thinking the same thing. Jo. Ryoko and me made an agreement. If anyone makes Sarah cry, we'll make them cry. So, like, stop looking like you're on the verge of tears. I mean, Joe, you're... If I make you cry, Sarah, that means Ryoko's gonna suck me, right? Don't. Hehe. <laughs> You're right, Joe. I'd better have you protect me. Yeah, whenever I see a traffic cone, I'll exterminate. Erase that from your memory. I'm. Well, that's nice, I guess. I'll rest a little. Uh, I think this will be the end of this episode. Uh, many, many short episodes nowadays. I got a new job last week. I started, and I'm so <laughs> tired of that every day. Maybe on weekend I can book record stuff and get some more regular uploads. But yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.